Daniel Snyder, 34, is an NFL. He was the youngest person to buy. In 1999, franchise started a wave of optimism and hope for Washington franchise, cornerstone of league. Out of 6 to 10 season, team continued to generate revenue from an ardent fan base that flocked to suburban Maryland Stadium, named after late owner Jack Kent Cook. The franchise's biggest concern at time was how finance the parking lot housed them all, a concern that didn't seem bother Snyder, a lifelong fan, who described buying team as the greatest thing that ever happened to me. In my dreams, Snyder said after the sale was approved, would win the Super Bowl next year. When he agreed in principle to sell Washington Commanders for a record $6 billion on Thursday, Snyder was devastated by the scandals that drew NFL investigations and legal investigation. The formerly arrogant, big spending team owner was pressured to change the team's name and logo, buy out partners, and eventually wake up from a nightmare that had turned out to be a nightmare for many. Despite Snyder's dream, the team never won the Super Bowl during his tenure, not even reaching a conference championship game.